So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to transfer players into their new uh, their new team. So like Messi into Inter Miami, uh, Sergio Busquets into Inter Miami, stuff like that. So as you can see, let me show you right now. I already moved uh, Messi and Busquets into Inter Miami. They're just all the way down here in the reserves. Take out, it doesn't really matter. Take out the center forward. And then take out this center back for Busquets. And then Messi. Put him up at the wing. And then Busquets for this guy here. And so I'm pretty sure it's like the same as last year. I, I made a, the exact same video. I think it's the same, but I think they separated team sheets and club trans, club transfers. Okay, so let me show you guys in Kunku as he's in Chelsea now. So let me take him away from his team. Uh, here we go. And then so here we go in Kunku. Player you're trying to get into another team. So you pick their club first that they're originally at now. And then you put them into what they just got transferred to. So in Kunku, let me go to England. So England and then Premier League, of course. And then let me go straight to Chelsea and then boom. Now he's on Chelsea. So... Let me go back now, and then let me sh let me prove it to you guys that t on team sheets. So let me go back to Chelsea. So Chelsea, the only thing is that uh, before you get into a match, you got to move them into the squad. So he's going to be down here somewhere. He here's in Kunku. Uh, doesn't really matter you take out. So here we go. Put him, put him at the top instead of uh, Havertz. And as you can see, you have in Kunku, stuff like that. It's pretty simple. You just got to, the only thing that's pretty time consuming is the thing that you got to go to each player and then put them in the exact, the exact team. And if it, you're trying to do like all the transfers so far, it's probably going to take a little bit, but that's the whole process. You could play career. You could play play now. You, the only thing you can do is play online, but hey, that's, that's how you do it. That's the only way you could do it. Other than that, you got to buy the new FIFA when it comes out. But as of now, since the new FIFA's not out. Uh, you could just do this, and then maybe it's a refresh. You could see how the players look on, on their new teams, how they play on their new teams, stuff like that. But yeah, that's basically it. Pretty easy. And yeah.